Granada. I mean, we played in Spain quite a lot, um, but first time here, and well, it's a stunning place. What can I say? We just got in about five o'clock and just mm -hmm. saw the city, and it's has a particular affinity for the Rizillos and the Rizillos, the offshoot of the Rizillos. And we've always had, um, we've always had, I, I don't know, the people just like us and so there's something, they get it. I think Spain gets us. about things in a different way and sometimes they inspire songs so a sort of cinematic view of the world makes you think about uh, creativity in a different way.
Yes, the Rosillos um, should be coming back to Spain again because we this year, because there is talk of us doing some festivals. I can't tell you which ones because I, I don't know. Uh, but there's talk of that and it probably will happen. And that goes on into spring of the next year, so there's plans for us to come back. Um, apart from that, the Rosillos need to be writing and recording new material because we put out an album called Zero about 18 months ago. Um, and that was after a big long wait, and so that was great and did very well, even though records nowadays don't do very well, it did, it did well, but we need to do, we need to get another one under our belt. And you know, apart from that, there are other musical projects that I'm involved in personally as well. I have another band called The Countess of Fife and I'm writing and performing with them as well.